fair in Southwest Bakersfield happening today in hopes of getting incoming students excited about science and energy. 23 ABC's Josh Sanders shows us what students learned and how the program has helped shape the future for current students. Josh. Yeah, Jessica, with climate change and the importance of renewable energy being a national conversation, students in Independent High School's Academy are looking for a future for the program and what they want to do after high school. For the second year, students in Independent High School's Energy and Utilities Career Academy put on a fair for Lakeside Middle School 8th graders. The Academy is a three-year program for independent sophomores, juniors, and seniors. It is designed to prepare students for careers in the science, technology, engineering, and math fields, also referred to as STEM. Those students get hands-on experience through partnerships with local businesses. It's just an opportunity for our students to take some of the information that they've been able to get from their mentors in the energy industry and pass it along to the eighth graders. Sophomores hosted an energy carnival with games teaching students the importance of energy and how their choices affect the environment. While juniors taught hands-on activities about energy use and production. The fair ended with seniors putting on a career fair showing eighth graders the different types of jobs within the energy sector. Like showcase like what their STEM things they have at their school so we like all those have robotics. Senior Courtney Olson is in her third year of the academy and says she sees the program as an advantage. We're definitely learning a lot about this stuff and it contributes to our other like science classes and stuff too. They can often say oh you learned about this in academy so let's go more into that and so it um, all ties together. And for Brandon Fortino, it has helped set a path for him after high school. The program have taught me a lot about how to save the environment and how to be more uh, re re renewable in a way and to be more sustainable. And that is why I wanted to study environmental science because I believe that I want to make changes in the future of environmental and to make this world a better place. The Academy giving both of them insight into innovative solutions to environmental problems and a plan for what they want to study in college. Now, both Courtney and Brandon are waiting to hear back from colleges they've applied to. Courtney's first choice is Princeton, while Brandon hopes to attend UCLA. Students interested in the academy have, a, have to maintain certain requirements. For more information on that, head to our website at turn23.com. In studio, Josh Sanders, 23ABC. Josh, thanks for that. Coming up next.